Hello everyone. Today I will talk to you about the topic understanding how frequency works through feelings, emotions, and thoughts. We often hear people talk about vibes or energy when referring to certain situations, people, or even places. For example, someone might say, I got a good vibe from that person, or the energy in this room feels off. What do these statements really mean? In simple terms, they're talking about frequencies, an invisible force that affects us deeper than we might realize. Every feeling, emotion, and thought you experience have its own frequency, which can affect not only your mood and mental state, but also your body and the people around you. In this video, we will explore how frequency work through feelings, emotions, and thoughts, and how understanding this can help you improve your life. First, what is frequency? To understand frequency, let's first look at what the term means. In physics, frequency refers to how often something repeats over the certain period. For example, sound has a frequency that we measure in vibrations per second. When you hear music, different notes have different frequencies. In similar way, your thoughts, emotions, and even a state of your mind and body can vibrate at a different frequencies. Higher frequencies are generally associated with positive emotions like love, joy, gratitude, and peace. Lower frequencies are connected with negative emotions such as anger, fear, jealousy, and sadness. Just as a radio tunes into different frequencies to pick up various stations, your body and mind can also tune in to different emotional frequencies based on your thoughts and feelings. Second, feelings and emotions as frequency. Your emotions and feelings are not just abstract concepts. They have real energy that affects you and those around you. Here's how it works. Positive emotions equal high frequency. When you feel emotions like love, happiness, and gratitude, your body and mind vibrate a higher frequency. You feel lighter, more energetic, and more at peace. This high frequency state attracts more positive experiences into your life, much like a magnet. Negative emotions equal lower frequency. On the other hand, when you feel emotions like anger, frustration, fears, your vibration is lower. This can leave you feeling drained, tired, or even sick. This lower frequency state, you might find that more negative situations seem to come your way. Understand this connection is important because it shows how much control you have over your own emotional state. By choosing to focus on positive feelings, you can raise your frequency and improve your well-being. How thoughts affect your frequency The thoughts are just as powerful as your emotions when it comes to influencing your frequency. In fact, your thoughts often create your emotions. For example, if you constantly think about 
things that make you anxious and worry, you start to feel those emotions which lowers your frequency. Positive thoughts equal high frequency. When you focus on positive, empowering thoughts, you raise your frequency. This might include thoughts of gratitude, self-love, or kindness toward others. As you shift your thoughts in positive direction, you start to feel better emotionally and your frequency will naturally rise. Negative thoughts equal lower frequency. On the other hand, if your mind is filled with negative, self-defeating thoughts like I'm not good enough or I'm never going to work it out, you lower your frequency. These thoughts can lead to emotions like sadness, anger, or hopelessness, which keep you stuck in the low frequency state. The key takeaway here is you can control your thoughts Why it's normal to experience negative thoughts from time to time. But the more you focus on positive thinking, the easier it becomes to shift your frequency upwards. The connection between my body and frequency Your thoughts and emotions don't just affect your mental state, they also impact your physical body. Scientific studies have shown that stress, fear, and other negative emotions can weaken your immune system, cause muscle tension, and even lead to chronic illness over time. This is because your body responds to the frequencies of your emotions and thoughts. High frequency equal healthy body. When you are in the state of love, joy, or peace, your body functions at its best. Your immune system is stronger, your muscles are relaxed, and you generally feel more energized. Low frequency equal unhealthy body. When you are in a state of anger, fear, or sadness, your body reacts negatively. Stress hormones like cortisol can rise. Your muscle may tense up. Your immune system weakens, making more susceptible to illness. So how to raise your frequency? Now that you can understand how frequency works through your thoughts and emotions, you might wonder how you can raise your frequency. Here are some simple practical ways to do it. Practice gratitude. Focus on what you are thankful for. Gratitude is one of the quickest ways to shift into higher frequency. Meditate or practice mindfulness. Take time each day to quiet your mind and focus on present moment. This helps reduce negative thoughts and emotion. Surround yourself with positive people. The people around you also have their own frequencies. Spending time with positive, high-energy individuals, you can raise your frequency as well. Engage in activities you love, whether it's a hobby, exercise, or spending time in nature, doing what you love naturally raise your vibration. Choose your thoughts. Be mindful of what you think. Whenever a negative thought comes up, try to replace it with more positive and powering one. In conclusion, your feelings, emotions, and thoughts all have their own frequencies, and they can affect not only your mental and emotional well-being, but also your physical health. 
by understanding how these frequencies work, you can take steps to raise your vibration and improve your life, whether it's through practicing gratitude, choosing positive thoughts, or spending time with uplifting people. You can have power to shift your frequency and create more joyful, fulfilling life. I hope this video can help you how to navigate your life using your high frequencies and show you how it works. Thank you so much for tuning in and if you like my video, please help me to subscribe to my channel and click the subscribe button. Thank you. Thumb up, like to support my channel.